to the Planet Mexico show and welcome to a week of new releases. So everything is already in shop available for you to pick up and will be on sale all weekend today through Sunday night. So let me go ahead and get in to what I have for you guys. We're moving straight on into the Christmas season. Um, let's see, I've got just two kits this week. But they're both really, really cute. Okay, this one is called Tis the Season. Um, I knew I really wanted to do this artwork, and she put out two different colorways, and I seen most everybody else did the other, like, uh, red and green, more traditional colorway, so I wanted to give you guys this option, and I, you know, you know me, I really love the pastels more than anything, and I really like this pop of black in it. I think that's super pretty. Did I say it's called Tis the Season? It's got a little bit of everything. Present wrapping and that's really pretty. So you will have the same uh, five options. There will be different skin tones, hair color options for this one. I just don't think I'm going to print them all out for new releases anymore. It's just a lot of extra work. Um, you got your little doggo here. Oh, I love, you guys know, non-traditional colors for Christmas. Both of these kits are very non-traditional. And I'm going to have an exclusive, my first exclusive Christmas one next week for you guys. It's also non-traditional, but it's so pretty. I can't wait. Oh, it's got red and green in it. It is the colors of our um, Pixie palette, if you haven't picked that up yet. But uh, it does have some pink and blue in it, so <laughs> that, that's what's non-traditional. Okay, let me go ahead and do foil colors for this one. I'm feeling silver. I'm feeling hollows for sure. Let's see. Look up the colors here. I always like to pull up both. Oh, you've got that green color. You could do the olive. I think olive would work. See, um, rose gold. Mm. I feel like this one is pretty limited. You could for sure do the golds, but I prefer silver with this one. So that's what I'm going to pull. Mm, I don't know about that one. Let's see. Yeah, I feel like this is so super limited. You could do the icy blue, cracked ice, regular silver, silver hollow, matte silver would look really nice with it. Sparkly hollow, you could do the silver wood grain. I think dusty rose could work, but that's it. <laughs> uh, not as many choices as usual, but still. Plenty. All right, for our add-ons, we do have a double box for this one. Really cute. You've got labels. I did pull in the black as an extra color. You've got checklists, you've got patterns, and then you do have a fashion sampler. You've got a tall box and then two regular size boxes and all of the options. And then you do have some washi. Um, I did the darker gray. It's kind of like a bluey gray. Um, so you've got the lighter gray. You've got that really pretty sagey green, pink. You've got the black. And then I did a different pattern. If you want to do a different pattern on that one. And then we do also have the underlays in five colors. Yeah. So you've got green, light gray dark gray, black, and pink. I'm not gonna lie, this one printed a little bit differently than what it looks like online. It looks kind of greenish almost online, but it printed out more bluey green, or bluey gray. So just keep that in mind when you're looking at the colors and you're like, that's not what that color is. <laughs> uh, it happens. All right, the next one is called Baking Spirits Bright. I just love the name of it. And pat myself on the back for that one. So it is very much like a Christmas baking one. Get a gander at all the boxes. I love the little treats for Santa plate there. 
your gingerbread house, just all baking. And again, you will have the fashion options on this one. Here's your extra box. I love the colors on this one too, very non-traditional. And same goes for this one. This one looks very greenish online, but it printed out more blue. Normally my printers print pretty true to what's online, but I don't know. Sometimes I look at it and it looks blue. Sometimes I look at it and it looks more green. So I don't know. Maybe your eyeballs will see <laughs> the green or the blue. You guys let me know. Um, let's see. Uh, foil colors. I feel like this one would be kind of limited to. I'm thinking coral though. That coral color for sure. And blues. I prefer silver with this one again. I feel like, mm, no, I think coral would be the way to go. Um, I guess you could do like a pink hollow with it. Possibly the blue eyes. I don't know. Your matte bronze, matte bronze weaves. Here are some golds against it. If you prefer gold over silver. Um, let's see. Pink ass. Mm, I don't know about that one. I feel like rose sparkle surprises me sometimes. Some of you, like for pre foiled stuff, you'll pick rose spark sparkle with something, and I'll be like, I don't really know about that. And then it ends up being, being so good. So, possibly. Could maybe even bring in the caramel. There is a lot of like browns that would go with that really well. Maybe even the antique, the matte gold. Um, the, here's the coral. Let's see. Again, dusty rose. And then here are all your, all your silvers with it. Regular silver. There's your cracked ice. There's the icy blue again. I feel like both of these are a lot of like the same colors and rose gold as well all right for your add-ons this one doesn't have a double box this artist seems to not do two different scenes and i just didn't have enough art left to like come up with one so you've got the labels the patterns and then well you've got checklists too but apparently i spaced on those um and you've got another uh, fashion sampler here. You've got your grandma uh, for the tall box. I thought that was really cute. And you got like a little, a little kiddo there. And then an extra scene here. You've got the regular options for these as well. And then as far as washi goes, um, you do have the coral. You've got the blue. Is that what I named that one? I guess. Pink, and then I did this pattern here. If you wanna change the pattern up, and then again, you do have all of your underlay options. We could get it together. There you go. All right, that's it as far as weekly kits. I do have a monthly kit for you guys. I did it in the Tis the Season art. So here's what that looks like. Don't forget we have uh, monthly samplers in the shop you can pick up. So you can use, I mean, obviously you're probably gonna use this for December, but if it was more of an anytime, whatever, just in case you've never gotten one of our monthlies before, uh, you can use them for any month. You can do a Sunday start, you can do a Monday start, however you want to do it. Um, and we do have the samplers in shop for foil that will cover pretty much everything you need the month the days of the week the numbers here are your sidebar options i did pull in the black on the monthly just to kind of make it a little bit different from the actual kit and then we do have our two different add-on options in a bill due and then those extra labels for the monthly and then I do have a couple of Pixie Pack reformats for you guys. So I'm trying to backtrack and pick up 
some fallish ones and next week I will try to do a few Christmas reformats so here's the first one I did this one in pumpkin hollow so it is just like pumpkin and leaves I think this is really great for fall um, I think it'd be great to use in November I know probably a lot of you move on to like Christmas kits in November but I personally usually don't um, and then here is pretty much the newest part of the kit which is the back page that's what I did for that and then the other one is for Thanksgiving um, I did this one in antique right yeah uh, this is pretty much the I didn't change anything on this one other than incorporating the back sheet got so very thankful give thanks a turkey and then Thanksgiving I thought that turned out really cute and then I do have quite a few uh, dashboards for you guys I've got them on my phone so let me pull those up um, I had a request to do our exclusive boo to you art in a dashboard so I do have a couple of those that's the first one and then that's the second one and then I've got let me see what else one okay I've got the tis the season the scene there and then I did the one um, wrapping presents and then from the baking spirits brought I did a couple of the boxes so there's the first one and then here's the second one all right that's what I have for you guys and again they are already in shop and on sale all weekend long uh, hopefully you like what I have hopefully you like what I have for you this week um, let me know what you're most excited about what you plan on picking up I hope to see you in the shop this weekend and I will talk to you guys later bye